Full name is Scott Stewart. Oh, I'm okay. licensed as William Scott Stewart. So I've been at Keller Williams for a year and a half, uh, in the business for about four years. Um, did five million in volume for the first time last year. And big picture, I'm looking to grow a team that uh, hopefully I'll be doing you know yearly a hundred million a year. So I've been at one other broker previously. I've gotten to know a couple other different brokers before I came to Keller Williams. I'd have to say the biggest difference is that you know at its core, Keller Williams is truly about you know training um, and making sure that their agents are basically empowered to lead the kind of business that they want as well as you know the kind of life that they want to live, uh, which is you know other. Companies definitely try and mimic that, but uh, no one does it like Keller Williams. Profit share, uh, it's great that, you know, A, the fact that Keller Williams is actually a profitable company, which is not a normal thing in the real estate business. Um, and, you know, the idea that, you know, if we help the business grow, the company is not afraid to then share that profit back to its agents who are helping the company grow. I think it's a great concept. So yeah, culture is great. Uh, you've got agents who are at all different levels and different points in their careers. And what I've found is that everyone, literally from the newest agent to the agent who's doing the most business in you know, the entire MLS, is more than willing to sit down with you, have a conversation, share ideas, you know, mastermind things. Uh, and everyone kind of has something to learn from each other. So that really you know, ties together our entire company, uh, no matter what office you're with. Before I came to Keller Williams, I think my vision of a big business was, you know, reaching a platinum level of doing, you know, 20, 20 million a year. I had done 3 million myself, so I thought I was kind of taking baby steps towards my bigger goal. Uh, when I came to KW, I immediately was looking at people doing 60, 70 million dollars a year. So it was pretty easy to, you know, get to that plateau or jump to that next step of 5 million a year uh, as a big stepping stone towards the next level. Um, and I anticipate doing even more this year. So, uh, so I went from doing probably about three million the year before Keller Williams to doing about five and a half uh, the first year with Keller Williams. Um, well, one of the first things I did when I came to KW was I hired a coach. Uh, that coach has basically taught me how to kind of draw a roadmap towards what the goals that I want to accomplish. Um, and that's been phenomenal in terms of organization, uh, how I stay in touch with my clients, um, just everything from top to bottom, how I'm running a business rather than just kind of hoping to sell a couple houses. Mindset, so again, as soon as I came to Keller Williams, I jumped into a program called Bold, um, and it's business objective, life by design. Uh, that course basically totally auto-corrected what my mindset had been, which was, you know, this is a a nice job to have to, this can really be whatever you want it to be. Uh, this business that we're in is limitless. It's got you know, no ceiling to what you can accomplish when it comes to real estate. Um, and I'd say that just completely changed how my mindset was when it came to you know, pursuing real estate further. So, I mean, that's the other thing is that, you know, other companies certainly offer training, uh, but Keller Williams, what you have is people who are doing it at such a high level, also teaching the classes. So. Not only is it somebody who you know, is your peer teaching you, but it's someone who's doing business on such a high level that you can really truly you know, take their lessons and build off of them. So uh, it's really been incredible. Since joining Keller Williams, uh, I'd have to say my entire life has changed. Um, I've got a new perspective on business, but also um, just how I want to live my life. Moving to Keller Williams, um, I have to say the number one thing was the support that I was offered. Um, both from agents as well as the staff. Everyone from day one um, you know, was able to help me out, make sure that I had a nice smooth transition and really made for you know, an easy move to Keller Williams. At my last brokerage, I feel like I had reached my peak. Um, and little did I know that joining Keller Williams uh, that was just the beginning of you know, what I could actually accomplish in this business. You know, there's no ceiling at Keller Williams because of the fact that at the core of what we are all about, um, it is mindset and realizing that this business that we're in is limitless. Uh, so there is no ceiling, and I think you know other companies um, might preach that idea, but we truly actually believe it here. You really are missing out if you're not joining Keller Williams because of the fact that um, there are no barriers to success here. Uh, everyone is absolutely looking forward to helping each other at any given point in time and 
you know, it's the amount of um, just everything about this business, um, everything about Keller Williams. It's, you know, the future of real estate. My name is Chris Gubb. I was with Tarvin Realtor in Tarvin. the same town, in Tarvin. Ridgewood. Started there and, and decided um, that, you know, when Keller Williams came to town, I didn't decide. When Keller Williams came to town, there was a big buzz and everybody was talking about it. They sort of knew they were a national organization and, you know, some people were joining the company and some people wanted to stay put and stay with the familiar um, company that they had been with for many years. Um, and. I, I, you know, it was a hard decision for many people to switch, but I think that anybody that really switched over, I, I don't, I know so few that aren't just ecstatic about the change. It was a life-changing move for me uh, within the first, well, the first year I doubled my business, and I did double my business every three years after that. Um, and again, it increased on the fourth year. I don't think it was quite double that amount, but um, what I decided that I, I sort of forced foresaw that we were, I was beginning to plateau because truly as an agent, I'm sure you understand that you, there's only so many houses you can show and only so many listings you can put on and that one body can actually do. So uh, at that point you can decide, you know, do I remain status quo and, and be happy with this amount of business um, or do I learn how to grow and expand my business using, you know, things that Keller Williams model offers to you and I decided to grow. Um, so at this point, two years after that decision, we have uh, two buyer's agents, I have two assistants, and I have somebody in charge of my marketing at this point, and um, business is, is quite good. Uh, as of this January, um, I did three times more than I've ever done in any January, which is normally a very slow time, um, and I foresee a wonderful 2017 with a lot of growth throughout the year. I, there came a point in my business where I had that choice to make, whether you remained the same and um, kept as a single agent uh, business or you decided to expand. Um, I decided to expand and went to you know many people that help you throughout Keller Williams on exactly what to do and they sent me, they gave me training opportunities, um, definitely advice on you know what steps to make and, and it was really a step-by-step -step, um, instruction and guidance on, on what to do first, second, third, which were, were great tools in um, coming up with a plan for myself um, and, and they did help me implement the plan and, and achieve my goals that I had of, of growing my business from you know a single agent to a true team. Um, there, there are many confusing steps in, on the way um, that, that, that you know I would often go and get guidance for as far as you know what what commission breakdown do you give this other person and um, how much do you pay them? You know, I was always worried about being fair to the person, yet I wanted myself to be fair as well. I didn't want to give away all my business. So even like intricate questions like that were answered um, that I found quite helpful in, in approaching uh, getting a team together for me. The company I came from um, had many restrictions um, on, there were a lot of you can't. You can't do this, you can't do that. And I found that method, and I don't think all companies are like that, it's just the, the one I happen to be with. Um, but I found that very restrictive in my opportunity to grow. Um, there were some ideas that I had that could never be implemented. Um, and once I had the opportunity to explore those creative ideas I had, um, I believe that had a lot to do with my business doubling uh, every year for the first three years I was there. Um, as well as there was something else that really intrigued me, which was the fact that if it's your listing, it's your lead. And if you think about most other companies, there's what they call, I don't know, every company calls it something different, but they call it an up desk or, you know, where they have somebody actually answering the phone and we all know what that is. And it's basically someone that maybe hasn't seen the house. They don't have a whole lot of interest in selling that one particular listing. Um, certainly not the same interest you do as a listing agent, and, and they don't know as much about the house. So the, the idea works beautifully because when that person is called, they are given a wealth of information about the listing. For the seller, that's a great selling tool to tell them about in a listing presentation, but for you as a listing agent, how nice is it to get every single lead on that listing you just got? I mean, if you think about it, you could get four to five, 
um, which is kind of our average. Sometimes it's three um, and sometimes it's seven leads per listing, um, which is really business you would never think of getting or never, never be able to capture at another company because when they call those companies, they're, you know, they're, they're, those leads or those, you know, those inquiries are then led to a buyer that, I mean, excuse me, a, uh, an agent that's answering the phone instead of yourself. I have to say this also is in contrast to where I was before, uh, which was you felt, I, I will never forget the first day I walked in. Uh, I'll, I'll never forget it. Um, Al Donnie was standing there. They're greeting me as I walked in the first day. And I just felt so welcomed just by that first day. And, you know, I, I don't see Al often anymore. But then I also, I mean, every time you walk in, there's agents there that um, you might not see them for a month or two because sometimes we don't always go into the office. Sometimes we don't make it to the meeting. We're all busy. But um, it really is an atmosphere of warmth and helpfulness. Um, if someone's struggling, before you even ask for help, they are, they're sort of intuitive. And, I, and I'm saying that they, as in overall, most of the agents there, they want everyone to succeed. Um, and you, you really get that feeling that they want you to succeed and they're helpful. And they're willing to share information. I mean, they're not going to give away all their secret business because, you know, I mean, quite frankly, we are competitors. So I'm not, I'm not going to say it's this fairy tale land of everybody telling everybody what else is going on. But people do help each other when they need help. And it's, it's definitely a wonderful and, and warm and inviting environment. When I reached that point where I felt like I was going to plateau very soon, in other words, when I reached the point where I've doubled all those years and now at this point there are only so many houses one individual can make. Um, or can show. There's only, there's just only so many houses you can show, or so many listings you can put on, and then then that that body, that person, that single person can no longer take that. So, um, that was when I decided that I would grow, and and there was where management and training uh, at Keller Williams all kicked in. Um, there are so many um, avenues to learn from, uh, from experts from all over the country coming to visit. Um, to tell you what they have done um, to, you know, the, the management within the office. Um, also, there are numerous videos. Um, you have opportunities to go visit um, at, at different seminars out of the state. They, they have something called Mega Camp and Family Reunion, which they highly recommend, and it's a wonderful experience. Um, I think each person is different. Um, I think that all of these things can be offered to someone and you can select those things that you think are uh, would be beneficial to you and not everything is for every person um, but I think that there are so many different things available that um, you, you'll you have lots to pick from you know depending on how you want to run your business and what your goals and plans are um, I don't use everything that the company offers because some of those things are just not the direction I want to go in whereas other things are much more valuable to me. Um, and I think it's, it, it allows you to be personalized like that, to pick and choose. And the most important thing for me is that it allows me to be independent, uh, to grow my own business and make my own business decisions, yet know I have this like safety net behind me if I ran into trouble, if I had a question, if I was struggling with a, an approach, I always had them as a backup, and that is pretty valuable to me. My business did double uh, for three years in a row when I first arrived at Keller Williams. Um, and, and during that time, um, the first year I was the fifth in the company, the second year I was the fourth, third year was third and second, and then for number, I was number one in, in the company for um, 2015 out of maybe 300 agents. Um, so. The growth that I would attribute, the, the, the factors I do attribute that growth to, I'd say obviously are hard work. Um, but I think that I'd have to go back to the independence of being able to see, to, to realize what your strengths are, um, and then being able to act on those strengths. Um, and having the, the ability to do that in an independent fashion. Um, because I, I just can't stress enough that you are your own business owner. And Keller Williams really feels that way. They, um, they check in with you as it's your company and they're there to help you. 
grow your company. It's not some kind of hierarchy that that um, is overseeing you. It's more of a checking in to see how can we help you grow your business. And they truly do consider it your business. Um, so it, it, you, you might read those things, but it, it really is true. They, it's how they consider their agents. And their agents are, um, you know, they consider their agents their, uh, the most important factor in the company. It's not management. Um, and if they have a good mix of agents and, and a good variety, whether it be, you know, in, in just beginning stages or, you know, the top producers, I think that they, that's their, they're feeling that, that is where the value of their company comes in and, and they support you. I understand how someone would be, have reservations in leaving a comfortable place because I had the same reservations. Um, you don't know, the unknown is always something that gives people a little bit of insecurity. Um, so you totally understand that. Um, but I think that the company has proven itself in the success rate. Um, you know, they're, they're number one in New Jersey MLS, and, they're not, and they have to be doing something right. Um, and the, the, I don't think my numbers, the doubling of my numbers, is an unusual um, happening. I really believe that it happens to many people once they land at Keller Williams. Um, their business doubles because they're given the tools they need to, to grow, the knowledge they need, um, and the, the exposure to, to what it takes to, to double those numbers. Um, so everybody will have their own way and approach, but I, I really feel if you took the leap, um, you would soon discover what I think a lot of other people have discovered, um, and that it is a, a, a fabulous place to grow your business. My name is Crystal Burns, Excellent. and I'm a licensed broker. Keller Williams, three years now. Excellent. Mm -hmm. And were you purchasing before? This is an experience totally different. Totally um, more training, more support. Here, I feel like there is a form, there's a pattern, there's something to help me continue to build on what I have. Before, it's kind of like potluck. Whatever was coming my way, I would take and do what I could with it. I feel like at Keller Williams, there's a plan, there's a focus, and then there's a continued journey that I can see in improving my business as opposed to what's gonna happen next. I feel total support, and not only that, I feel like there is a way of showing me a pattern of continuous business. Before, I just always felt like, oh my gosh, you know, what, what am I gonna do next? So, mm -hmm. I like the fact that they give you a footprint and they help you in building. So yeah, um, I came kind of back into the business back in like, I want to say 2010, 2011. And since then, I would say from last year to this year, I've increased my business by a little over 55%. I do, I try to do all of it. I try to go to the classes. Um, I try to do like outside of uh, the classes, go to different co coaching seminars that different agents in the office offer, which I think is phenomenal because uh, working at other offices, people didn't want to impart their information. So um, I feel like you go to the different Keller Williams offices and all the agents are willing to share their successes and how you can possibly make what they did or take something from what they did and make it your own. That's my next focus. Um, as my business increases and as I start to really build my business uh, you know, focus. I, I'm starting to run into different people, you know, that I've been speaking to. I had a team before, and the team that I had, it was kind of haphazard. They liked me, I liked them, we got, we formed a team. Now, I'm looking at my team situation differently, because I want to bring in someone who has strengths where maybe my strengths are, and someone, you know, who I can kind of help build with, you know what I'm saying? So I want to bring in the right balance. So I've kind of been taking my time, but yeah, that's my focus for 2017, a team. The support, um, a lot of people talk about profit share. I didn't come to Keller Williams for profit share. I came to Keller Williams to build on my strengths and my business and for the support. Um, the profit share was just the gravy to me. So that's the reason why I kind of think that when I meet agents, they tend to ask me, though, oddly enough, they say, why did you go to Keller Williams? I never say, why are you at wherever you are? I never do that. But now that I'm here, I find so many people are in inspired about why you went, because I left two companies. So, and they know that I stay 
when I go someplace. So I think that they were intrigued to know, what made you go there? And so I just say to them, totally different culture in business. And that's what I was looking for to build my brand. Well, first of all, the business is so high tech. Um, I feel like it moves at a much faster pace. When I started in this business, we didn't use computers. Homeowners were looking at newspapers to find their homes. Now, in the business, it's all internet. Everybody is online. Everybody's communicating with you electronically. And I find that that kind of takes a little bit of the personality out of it. So what I've started doing is, yes, I have everybody Facebook, whatever, but I built a business page, a Keller Williams business page for myself. And I let my people know, you know what, come to my business page, see what I'm doing in business, but always, you know, don't forget me personally because I'm still crystal, you know what I mean? So that's kind of how I stay in touch, but I think technology has changed this business tremendously. I also want to say that I think Keller Williams is, I'm, I'm not a newbie in the business. I've been in the business a long time. But I think if you're starting in the business, this is the first stop you should make, interview with a team leader, because I think Keller Williams gives you something you're not going to see in any other office. And that is a relationship with your business and supporting you and building your business. You don't see that anywhere. It's, very, it's, it's I think, the best thing a, a new person in the game should, could do. Since joining Keller Williams, my business quadrupled. My last brokerage, I was at a million three, and last year I hit 7.2 million. So that's a 434% increase. When I joined Keller Williams, my life changed. and my career changed and I wasn't going to stay in real estate until I joined Keller Williams. When I joined Keller Williams, I got the most amazing training that I could ever find anywhere. I was taught by some of the most professional people that I could ever imagine being in business with. I've been in real estate for two and a half years. And when I came to Keller Williams, I had tears in my eyes. I wanted to quit the industry. And with the help of my team leader, we set some goals, just a few, and one of the goals I wanted was to pay off half of my credit card debt, which totaled $72,000. So last year, not only did I pay half, but I paid it all. In my last brokerage, it was a lot about the top producing agents, and they did a lot of focusing on them, talking about them, rewarding them. And when I came to Keller Williams, they treat everyone the same and they welcome you no matter what stage of your career that you're in. They're willing to train anyone and everyone and give you the absolute best that they can every single day. If you want to start your career in real, real estate, I suggest coming to Keller Williams because of the training that they give you helps you become a great agent. Uh, this field has a lot of talented and seasoned people in it. So to be a part of that organization you want to go out there with your best foot forward and to start with another brokerage where they don't give you the kind of training that Keller Williams does, it's kind of a step backwards. So we want to put you out there in the field with great experience under your belt already taught by some of our top producing agents. I just joined MAPS Coaching. Uh, my husband and I are both in the real estate business and once a week we, we have a discussion and a, a conference call with our coach and she sets things for us to help better our business and she gives us goals and it's very easy for us to hold ourselves accountable now so we produce and be the agents that we want to be and have the lifestyle that we want to have when i just when i started to consider switching to keller williams i spent a lot of time unhappy telling my husband every night how stressful this was I cried a lot when I came to Keller Williams and talked with the team leader. Um, I told her about the struggles that I had and I was in tears in her office and she promised me that she would help me change my life and she certainly did with the help of her and the rest of the staff you know, at Ridgewood Keller Williams. The company culture is great. It gives you something to um, share with other people in your life. It gives you motivation to be the best you can be. It encourages, encourages you to come from contribution, which is always great. We're constantly donating our time and, and part of our you know, commission checks go to KW Cares. So it's a, it's a nice reminder of how um, to treat other people and be treated back that way. Since joining Keller Williams, my life has changed in so many ways. Personally, business-wise, 
Um, I've accomplished so many goals that I didn't think that I could ever achieve. Uh, and, and taking some of the courses like Bold, it's helped me to see things in a different way and become happier in so many aspects and grateful. I feel blessed. I feel like I never want to leave Keller Williams. My business has grown 434% since joining and I could never imagine that anywhere else. I become a great agent with the help of all the training and guidance that I've received from the people at my office. Other agents that have been in the business a long time welcomed me in and helped me in any way that I could. The people are just different at Keller Williams. There is no ceiling because you can go to, you can go to any level with Keller Williams, whether you wanna just do real estate or get involved in some of the other things that they have to offer, being a part of all the company activities, um, maybe becoming a team leader or a part of the organization in that fashion. We, we're not just a brokerage. We don't just come in, look on the computer, look for houses and go home. We're a family and you know, we work together and we help each other and there is no ceiling. We just keep going and going and going. It's a company built by agents for agents because everyone just thinks about how they want it done and how they want to work as far as being in the industry. So it's not built by some corporate platform. They don't understand what we go through on a daily basis. They, they don't know what we need as far as training is concerned. So our leadership council helps build our company to suit our needs. We aren't just a cookie cutter corporation. It's built by agents for agents. This is a company that is not focused on itself as a company. This is a truly uh, agent-focused company. And um, it's been, it, it, you will experience it on a day-to-day -day basis. They don't work on their brand. They don't believe brand sell homes, agents sell homes. And as a result, you're not competing with the brand. You are only working and everything is geared to help you to do the best. Uh, that you can do as an agent. So the culture, it's interesting enough, even though we are in a very competitive industry, and which is the nature of the business, yet you, n people do not feel that level of competition and cutthroat competition within the, the market center. And partially is because the company managed to come with this uh, magical uh, concept where basically everybody benefits from the profitability of the market center. So even if I'm out there uh, competing with fellow agents on getting a listing or getting a buyer to work with me, if I end up losing that prospect, that, uh, that listing or the buyer to a fellow agent from my market center, I'm still uh, going to benefit from that because it will grow my market center, the profitability of my market center, and I'm directly uh, connected to that. So therefore, it t completely changes the whole atmosphere of, uh, of the market center. They are committed, this company is committed to training. And the training is on an ongoing basis always new and better and the most updated technology and systems that are out there. And it's all geared into bringing it and making it uh, relevant to the real estate industry. So while I used to do my business as I just went along without planning much, this company really helps you to systemize everything. First of all, it helps me to put goals and targets to uh, what I want to achieve. And then it helps you really to, to achieve it. It's not just to say, I hope this year I'm going to improve myself. That's a nice statement, but if it's not coming along with tools and systems, how to reach those higher goals or better, um, you know, better accomplishments, then uh, you end up by, it may work, it may not work. But if, if you are going to implement what this company offers, um, there is basically really no limit to uh, what one wants to achieve. And it doesn't matter if one wants to achieve actually higher income or more free time or just leverage and create a, a team. It, that is not the issue. the issue. You pick and choose what is good for you on an individual basis. But the company will teach you to do whatever you do in a more effective way. So I was seven years initially with Cobra Banker. 
And seven years afterwards with Sotheby's, Paulman and Sotheby's, and now for uh, three years here with uh, Keller Williams, and it's an absolutely amazing experience for me. Yeah, absolutely. In fact, I think that the newer agents will even, to some degree, can benefit more. Everybody can benefit immensely, but a new agent, for instance, and that's what I tell fellow agents that are in other companies, where they think only at a certain level it makes, this, it makes sense to move. It's a complete mistake. A new agent will be taught systems rather than he doesn't need to unlearn bad habits. He will learn good habits from the beginning and he'll come into an environment and an atmosphere where there is a lot of support, a lot of help. A brand new agent does not need to unlearn bad habits. They will, from the get-go, be in an environment where the right habits are going to be instilled in them. They will be taught uh, the right systems to implement and, and, and will reach great goals. So it doesn't matter at what level one performs. It matters what are the systems and what are the principles that you are going to, um, uh, to uh, learn from and how you are going to perform accordingly. So it does, the, the level of perf the individual performance is of no relevancy as far as considering the move. So when talking with other agents, they say, oh, we also join certain courses, certain uh, classes. But, but what I want to stress out here, that the classes here are really completely geared to create, um, to create a business approach. We are in an industry that many times we as agents, we don't run our business in a business-like fashion, including myself. And since joining this company, I understand how we really can, by um, putting goals uh, in a much more systematic way and, um, and putting it um, uh, with uh, putting uh, numbers to our goals, how really to pursue, um, how really to... <laughs> I totally wrong. Agents are afraid of changes. Many agents are afraid of changes. Everybody is in their comfort zone. I can totally relate to this. I was myself set in my own ways and I felt comfortable and I did well. And, um, but I only now in retrospect understand that uh, if one takes that, that leap of faith and does that change, it is, um, it's, it's worthwhile. Excellent. Since joining Keller Williams, I'm looking at my whole business in a much more professional, uh, business-like fashion. Excellent. Uh, moving to Keller Williams? was hard initially because I had to um, rock the boat and change my ways and leave a, a, a situation that was very comfortable for me. Um, but I never regretted it for a minute. It paid off. Excellent. At my last brokerage, Oh, you said that already. They were all about the brand. Um, they were all about the brand, and it was highly competitive uh, without benefiting anybody out uh, with that, that competitive atmosphere. It was not beneficial to anybody. And um, while in this atmosphere, in this environment, it does create motivation for people to step out and help each other, while it doesn't compromise your own success. At Keller Williams, they're laser focused on putting the agent first. They do, because they completely understand that uh, a company is only good as, the, as their agents, and only the individual agents are the ones that make a difference. And it's not uh, some, uh, some, uh, um, some company that will create a sale. It's the actual salesmanship, the actual effort of the individual person to make a difference. So they are not competing with that individual. And that's, that's really the, the heart of it. Okay, so stick it in my face. I'm an agent. Let's say you and I are friends from high school. I'm, I've been 20 years doing the same thing. Tell me, you know, straight up. So, so let me just ask you something. Um, so the company that you are working under, underneath, they pay your mortgage, they pay your expenses, are they in charge of your, of your college, of the bills that you pay for your children? I mean, you are the one that need to make the income, you are responsible for your income, so why would you enable and facilitate a, a brokerage, a concept 
that is not for you, is not geared to make you profitable. It's geared to make an owner, an individual owner, an individual company profitable rather than yourself. Why would you continue if you can do everything to benefit your, your, you and your family? Why would you continue that way? Good, we're good. Thanks so much. Jane Roberti, for about a year and a half, 12 years. So I've been in the business almost 14. There's more flexibility here. I think they feel that it's our business and, of course, you know, within a range, but I felt that I had much more opportunity to do things that I don't think I would have had the opportunity and even extracurricular. I'm somebody who gives back a lot to charity and I, I started a um, exercise class with one of the New York Jets and all I had to do is ask and it was yes immediately. That wouldn't have happened before. I had a career year and I think the difference was I'm happier. I feel that I'm, I'm never micromanage they believe in us that that we will do you know the right thing and i felt that the i felt very comfortable with the people you know it was a hard move because i was in the same place like a marriage for 12 years and i did like the, a lot about the other company but i feel that this one lets you be yourself um, and lets and truly encourages you and they also when you do well one thing I work well with like in school if you do well they promote it and I think that subtle not wanting you to com compete with others but compete with yourself has worked for me I don't know why they didn't but we in my 12th my 10th year maybe they started to do awards and it they felt it wasn't something they wanted to do but for me it actually keeps me going to see, I want to be in the top 10 every month and it makes me work harder for myself, not as a competition with others. What I like is that we have a lot of great classes that we offer and um, for new agents or for continuing agents and I enjoy teaching the class that I do about the waterfront and selling renting and I find that very fulfilling to do that. I came on a silver level of like, t uh, I guess that's 10 million. And I, my, uh, my first year here was really only a three month year. So I did a little better in the silver. I did a little, um, I actually did about almost 12 million. So I missed like what we call the gold by a small amount. And my full year, here I went up to about 15 million and I do feel that that was a lot to do with how much respect you do get at this company and how you're encouraged to think creatively and and to um, work with others and I find that everybody is very helpful to each other and I can use to reach out more to people and when they reach out I do try to help because I like that about this company. We have a lot of new people in Fort Lee and I do like helping. And then if I, my mom was in the hospital and I, I, for a month I couldn't work and I was able to reach out to other people and I found that unusually more here and I was really happy that I could do that and needed it and I do the same and I would do the same in a moment. Since joining, I'm more relaxed. <laughs> I feel respected. Um, I feel that the new people look up to me, which is kind of nice, and I feel that it's enabled me to be happier, so I've worked, I've done more as a result. Less complaining, more work. Moving to Keller and Williams, I have been helped from the start in going into technology that we didn't have to do before. And I found that um, the staff was very helpful. I had to learn very quickly because I was leaving a business, starting a new company and continuing working and there was no downtime for me. So I found that the staff here was very good at teaching the new technology and actually that helped me. Now I don't want to do paper anymore. I find that how could I never have just done it all on e-signing? Before Keller Williams, there wasn't 
a real team approach. Even though I don't have my own team, I know that I can count on others, they can count on me. I feel here that it's a very, more like um, helpful. People, even if they don't have time, we all make as much time as we can to help each other. Very down to earth. And I really need that because I'm extremely harried, sometimes busy. So I like that, that it's an underlying culture that we're all busy, but we help each other. There's no ceiling here because whereas, I think in some companies, they don't want you or let you take a listing of 4%, for example. And in some cases, you've worked with them before or your competition is going to do it and it's worth it to you to take a 4% listing. It's not your goal, but I haven't been able to do it before with people who I've work with a number of times and they felt that and it was a high priced um, property and they felt that I should be able to and I lost it so now I've built on the fact that I can do within reason what is in in you know other circumstances may be necessary to do I do believe that they feel that this is our business it's not the name like I've been at places where yes the name has been special but that's not how they look at it I think Keller Williams looks at we're a name, we're spread over, and we're getting to be top people in the market. But it was more that it's not about the company. They try to help us make our business. And I think, I feel that has really been true. And I really appreciate that very much. Even I, who was hesitant because it's easier to stay where you are, like in a marriage sometimes, I truly think that there's something for everybody here and I feel that I have grown as a person because I feel that they have appreciated you feel the appreciation for you here and I would I would suggest that you really think about it I'm so glad I did and maybe I should have done it earlier but there's always a time to do it and I I really am glad I did Sergio Shortino from Keller Williams Ridgewood Wyckoff okay, cool. yeah you were saying there's so much uh... um, Education-wise, what to do to up your business. Um, from mindset, which that was the biggest. Um, believe in that the height of what I believed prior um, was nothing compared to what I think can be done now and what I see being done. Believing that you can, what you can accomplish. Where before I thought, like I said, um, the number that I thought was unattainable now is so attainable and, and raises that bar that much higher. Um, after coming here. Prior year, th three prior years before coming to Keller, I was at six and a half. Uh, consistently, it felt like that was the ceiling. Uh, my first full year at Keller, I broke eight. And this year, um, we're in the middle of March, and I'm over five million in two and a half months. Mindset, um, making the calls. Making the calls, doing what they, what they suggest that you do versus hoping for that business to come to you versus going out and actually getting that business. Instead of being reactive, I'm proactive. That's the difference. And I'm being purposeful with lead generating, uh, follow up, um, past clients um, that would not really be um, looked after prior to coming here. Um, and now the, the referrals are just coming in from those past clients. Okay, so prior to coming, I'd heard of profit share and everyone I said, yeah, yeah, profit share, is it, is it real? But I could definitely say after a few months in the company, people just followed me over, um, called me and just, it's not really about recruiting, they, they want to know about the company. They're truly interested. You share your experience and they did come over. Um, so early on, I started receiving profit share from pretty much you know, maybe the third month into it. And now I'm getting it consistently month after month and the checks are pretty significant. So how does that affect or impact, you know, the teamwork and that kind of stuff? Well, everyone, everyone's on the same team, right? The, the better the office does, the better everyone does. There's more profit, there's, there's more market share. Um, it just helps the morale, it helps the team, it helps the office. I mean, it's like nothing I've ever seen before. I do. I, I've been in Keller for two years and I've gone to the BOLD program three times. Um, and I would recommend it to anyone. It, it's paid off um, tremendously and it's caused habits that I have now as far as lead generation and follow-up that 
has increased my business. Since joining Keller Williams, uh, my business has become purposeful. That's the number one word that just keeps coming to mind. I'm, I'm doing the actions and I'm purposeful about my business versus just going about my day. I'm purposeful about doing it. Moving to Keller Williams was uh, scary, but I took the leap and I'm so glad I did and I wish I would have done it years ago, years ago. So I see these new agents coming in now and they have no idea how lucky they are to be coming in fresh and starting at this company. <laughs> it was funny if one day you see me on this video, like, I, I used to be a video guy. You should. I'm this, telling you. When I did the <laughs> <laughs> When I did the video, I joined. <laughs> at my last brokerage, it was all about the broker, the brokerage, the company. Come in here, they teach you that it's about the agent, which that's what it really is. It's about the agent that brings the business in. It's not about the name. And that's what Keller is huge on. Before Keller Williams, like I said, before I was, I was reactive to my business, leads kind of came in and... We're here, I'm proactive, I'm going after leads. Follow up, it's just a, a more purposeful business. Okay, at any other place, they, they tell you that there, there's no ceiling in real estate, but when you come to Keller, they ask you, what do you wanna make? And no matter what that number is, as crazy as you may think that number is, if you tell them, they're gonna back into it and tell you exactly what you have to do to get to that number. And it's almost scary at first, but then you see the results and you, be you believe it, and it's true. Really? Wow. Yeah. And they believe in you, and that makes all the difference in the world. That's 100%, because I don't feel like management is dictating to us. We work as one, right? This is what we need. I mean, uh, management, uh, president, vice president, they, they're all agents. They've been in the same trench as we've been, and um, they work together. They, they, they ask us for our input. I mean, it's just there's so much sharing, too, literally from the top down. You know, what do you think about this? What do you think about, I mean, it's, it's amazing. It's, it truly is amazing. There's no better place to build your real estate business because once again, the sky is the limit and they're gonna give you the training and the tools to hit whatever goal you set. Um, it can't be too high. It's how big can you dream, really? Take the leap of faith is what I would, this is what I, how I did it, what, basically what I was thinking when I came over. Um, if you hate it, you can leave, you can take your business, you can take your listings with you. Most other companies will keep that business. You have nothing to lose. There's absolutely nothing to lose. You come over, you try it out, and you will not leave. I mean, it's amazing. It truly is amazing. It's changed my business tremendously. I basically had a difficult time in the first you know, 12 years really getting the business to take off. And I was actually just about to throw in the towel. And my husband said I could probably make more money at ShopRite. And then Patty Jalal, um, we were from another company, but she basically mentored me. And I thought I had a pretty good business going. And then I went to Mega Camp, and I couldn't believe the numbers that I was hearing. And I realized that I had just only scratched the surface of this business. So I came back and I started taking all these classes from Keller Williams, and my business basically increased 600% in three years, which I, no one was more surprised than I was. But um, I'm very grateful to Keller Williams. I love their education. Um, well, some of their classes that they have are, all, actually all of them are fantastic, but I attribute it to Bold. Um, I, the first time I took Bold, I absolutely hated it. And then the amazing thing happened a few months afterwards, my business just started to increase. So I took it the second time. Then I had a love-hate relationship, but yet again, my business increased. So finally, by the third time, I was like the first one online going, take my check, please let me in the class. So I really think that many of the things that I learned um, were through Bold, and I think it's an incredible course, and I attribute a lot of my success to that. It's, it's like a family. It's amazing. You know, people will joke and say it's like we're all on happy pills or something, but the truth is the company treats us with such respect and as professionals, and we are that happy, and um, everybody helps each other out. Um, it's... It's a tough business, you know, to be in. We're all competitors, but yet it's amazing. You'd never know it because everyone's always there with the lending hand, you know. Here's my opinion on, on a price of a home. Here's my listing presentation. It's very unusual to find that in this business. Well, they, they have wonderful classes constantly. I mean, you can literally be in classes three days a week in the office. You actually have to stop yourself, you know, and say, okay, it's time to get some business done. So, yeah, there's many others, you know, that are wonderful. Um, profit sharing is incredible. Um, it wasn't making my decision to move to Keller Williams that really didn't, I didn't think about that. But it's turned out to be wonderful because um, getting a check every month, you know, it's just, what can I say? You're getting a wonderful check every month.
I don't know what to say about that. <laughs> I mean, it's hard to, um, it's, I, I, well, never, it's like a little retirement plan, which is wonderful. I mean, basically all you're doing is, is, you know, yeah, you're referring someone, you know, to a wonderful company that, you know, you love. And you, I love Keller so much, it's pretty hard not to talk about it, you know, because if I'm that happy, you always want to help somebody else, another agent, to be the same way. And uh, with profit share, uh, basically there's a portion that is attributed to, contribute to the uh, profit share, and those agents uh, share within that. So, and that's a forever thing. You could actually, I believe it's um, like your children can inherit it and all. We don't really do too much. We kind of turn that over to our team leaders. You know, we don't, uh, we're, we're not quite as knowledgeable about explaining it to people. Yeah. So they basically, it's just tell them how great Keller Williams is and yeah. we leave it to them to do the rest. Yeah. And if awesome. they come, they come. Yes, and I happen to be in charge of Red Day. So <laughs> uh, Red Day is when we give back to the community. Everybody, every Keller Williams agent, which I believe we're over 120,000 worldwide, and that day everyone um, contributes some time to a community service. So we basically have um, Alpine Learning Center, we're painting for them, uh, different towns, we'll do floral plantings for them, uh, we collect food for the homeless from the grocery stores. Um, it, it's an amazing day, you know, our red day when just every agent is just giving back to the community as a thank you. I am. I am. I'm in the very beginning process, really, of, of developing a team. I have uh, one buyer's agent right now. Um, Without them, I've never even, I never even thought of the concept of developing a team, and they've been incredibly helpful. And I've made some mistakes right in the beginning, and they've helped me to correct them, and it's, it's going well. It's certainly a process, but it's very exciting, and I love it. Since joining Keller Williams, my life truly has changed for the better. I'm so much more successful. <laughs> All right. All right. Okay. Since joining Keller Williams, my ch my life has changed uh, incredibly because the truth is, I'm just so much more successful than I was before. Truly, more successful than I ever dreamt I could be. And this is only the beginning. There's there's more to come because I've only implemented about half of what you know Keller has taught me. It's just taking time. So. Moving to Keller Williams, I think I, I really love the technology. That was a big change for me. Um, and people sometimes can be very afraid of that. And I'm not a tech person at all, but they've made it very, very easy. And it's wonderful because we are on the cutting edge. At my last brokerage, I really can't say anything negative about them. I mean, they were wonderful. Um, but Keller Williams is just, it's like working for a Fortune 500 company. Um, everything that they have to offer is just so much more. But I can't really say anything negative about okay. them, so. Yeah. Before Keller Williams, I, I basically think I'm a very, I'm a totally different person than I was before I joined Keller. Um, I was definitely shyer, didn't know how to really go after the business. I was good during a transaction, but I didn't know how to get the business. And Keller really taught me that. There is no ceiling in this business, certainly not at Keller. And, and they really mean it. The fact that I increased my business 600% is as much of a surprise to me as it is to anyone else. And at this point, I plan on doubling it this year and then doubling it the next year. And there are just so many people out there that are an inspiration that are already doing this. And every time you go to family reunion and mega camp, you're meeting these people. And they're more than happy to talk to you about the business and tell you how they got there and what they're doing and share all this information with you. And I expect to be one of them one day. I'm, pretty, I'm trying to go from being an agent to a business owner. And one of the differences, I think, is um, having people to work for you, the fact that I don't have to be the one showing a house every single time. Um, it will give, hopefully give me a little bit of time because I do work seven days a week. So that's one of the beauties of having a team is having some backup. And yeah, I mean, that's, that's one of, like having a team member to come in there and, and help you out is great. Um, I'm learning so much about technically, you know, keeping the books, doing business. Um, it, it's just, it's amazing, you know, different books that we're reading. And it, it's a real educational process because I, I, I'm almost getting there. I'm going from being a realtor to the business owner, but not quite there yet. But thanks to Keller and all their classes, I'm definitely getting closer.
That's some, the leadership. We're, we're very lucky. We have incredible leadership. People that really, really care about you and care about your, whether you're going to succeed or not. And they're there to mentor you and help you. And I think that's a huge contributing factor to why Keller Williams agents are successful. Because they really are by your side um, every step of the way. And whenever you need them, your door is always open. And uh, they're very receptive and extremely helpful. I love Keller Williams so much that it's, it's hard to understand sometimes why even people you know, are over at some of these other companies. Um, and they just, Keller Williams has so very much to offer you between the education, uh, the fact that we're like a family, uh, the fact that people are always there to help you. It's not cutthroat, you know. Um, you're just surrounded by people that all want to help. You have an administration that just is always reaching out to you. What can I do for you? How can I help you? Um, that is just, I feel bad because sometimes these agents are hitting their head against a wall like I did for so long. And it, it's out there and it's possible. If I can do it, anybody can do it. So um, come to Keller Williams. It's definitely the place to be. Bert, okay. that's great. You're yeah. like one of the best ones. Oh, like. no. Eileen Gonzalez, being in Keller Williams in comparison to any other, the other company that I was with, it's like night and day. Um, completely different. Um, Keller Williams is, uh, an, I would say, in a league of its own. Um, it's different from in every aspect, from education to culture, which you hear a lot of that. Um, we're big on that. And um, in just in that support system that they bring to the agent. And whether you start like me as a part-time, because I still had young children, and then decide that, you know what, now I can make this a business, they'll take you from that point A to point Z and make sure that you have the map and be there, get there. So that's where I am. I'm in my little, the map that they have created for me on my way to building my own business. There's so many things within Keller Williams that sets it apart um, from just the way the dynamics of everyone within. Um, which I think we all know that Mo created <laughs> for all of us, which is the culture of care and community. Um, the, one of the, the, the mottos that they have is um, it's God, uh, family, and then business. So that's, that just creates the whole culture of how people should think about themselves and how they, that same uh, idea bringing it to their clients so that their clients feel the same way that they're being taken care of by someone that does see the whole picture and not just the business aspect of a real estate agent. Um, in education, it's also uh, it's sets itself apart. Um, I've done Bold, uh, which is this great program to be in. Uh, I've done Ignite. Uh, and all these uh, programs right now, I have a productivity coach, which has been helping me tremendously in creating that roadmap to my success. And, um, and then you can do also separate kinds of coachings uh, through MAPS Coaching, which is created by Diana Kakoska. And it's just as big as you want and as little as you want. You, you decide how, what do you want to do within Keller as far as education. And about your structure as a business, you read the MREA, our red book, and then it shows you how to also, um, where do you want to be and how big or small you want to be. I was a part-time, so I would do just small things here and there, family, friends. I never looked at it from the way that Keller makes it once you decide that this is what the way you want, you, you know, this is not just going to be something you do, but it's actually a business that you're built in. And, um, and what I've seen is that um, especially moving into um, where I am now, which is the office in, in, in Tenafly, I find that I've seen my business grow. I've been here close to three years now, coming soon. Um, and I have to say that every year it has doubled itself. So you focus, what you focus on expands, right? And that's exactly what I've lived while I've been here. There is a huge difference in what we want in life. And if you want to create that change, you need the vehicle that's going to take you there. And if you truly, truly want to create that change, 
in the minimum amount of time instead of just waiting to see what happens. Don't wait until things happen to you. In Keller, they teach you how do you make things happen for yourself. They teach you how to fish so that you can grow your business and then you can become this amazing fisherman. You have all the opportunities. They teach you how to use the models, the systems. There is no reinventing the wheel. It is there for you. It's just a matter of getting in, making sure you follow the patterns and the models that they teach you, be consistent, do your lead generation, get your listings. Eventually, you'll be able to leverage yourself and then become a true business owner, which is what we all come into real estate to begin with, to become great business owners. Keller Williams does support you in anything you dream, from your team leaders, to your OPs, to um, your brokers, all the staff, everyone in your system will help you to succeed. Your other agents want you to succeed because you are in a profit share company. You, I, you know, most of us don't think that we'll be able to retire. You actually can if you put your mind to it because you, there is a system for that too. So for me, Keller has everything. Plus, it also has, there is no ceiling. Um, when other, other companies we're watching now creating the teams, for us, we're beyond that. Now we're into expansion. So we're always a step ahead, or I would say miles ahead of most companies. And it's just a matter of knowing that this is the vehicle to make as much money as you want, to have the life that you dream of, and in a way that is so satisfying because it's about people. As the Director of Agent Services here at Keller Williams Town Life, I assist you in transitioning to your career here at Keller Williams. As the technology coordinator, I teach classes and assist agents in all of their technology needs. Hi, I'm Carly. I'm the Director of Agent Services here at Keller Williams Town Life. I assist agents in making the transition to the career at Keller Williams. As the technology coordinator, I teach classes on, on all the new technology and I assist agents with their technology needs. After graduating college, I was drawn to Keller Williams as a company. My mother was a real estate agent and she inspired me to join. Um, I started working as a transaction coordinator for a top producing agent and then I found this new role of agent services coordinator. So there's a lot of growth within Keller Williams and as a, as a young professional that means a lot to me. Technology is always growing and in this fast-paced world it's easy to get overwhelmed. So my job here is to help agents focus on what they do best and then I can just be there to support them in their technology needs. Um, I moved to Keller Williams three, three years ago when I think that uh, I thought that I reached my limit and I hit a ceiling. And since I moved to Keller Williams three years ago, I, my business increased by 260%. My production went from 30 million to 78 million, and the sky's the limit. Keller Williams uh, enables me to think that there's no ceiling, there's always endless possibilities in the horizon. As much as I want to put effort and action into it, you can uh, achieve your goals. Keller Williams is designed by agents for agents, and the whole model and every outline is to create systems and models to help to support teams to expand um, thinking as a business owner and get your productivity to the highest level possible. Specifically for me as a, as a top producer, I always can reach out to a higher top producer around the world, get their uh, ideas. Everything is outlined in the Millionaire Real Estate by Gary Keller. You just need to follow the models and systems. The training help you to um, achieve your goals, to train your group and your uh, agents in your group. And if you follow the model, there's no way you can su cannot succeed. Our training in Keller Williams is designed to every entry level. Uh, if you have a new agent, top agent, mid agents that want to have a bigger uh, production, it helps me to train uh, people that just came to the company, people that are seasoned, 
I can brainstorm with other uh, top uh, producer within the area or not in the area. There is always something going on in our market center, in and out. Um, that you can take uh, some ideas from. The culture, obviously, you always come with a smile to the office. I think it's a big plus. Uh, it's always win-win. Um, if it's within the negotiation, if it's cooperation with other colleagues. Um, and I think we're really trying to achieve uh, the best solution to our clients, if it's sellers or buyers, in a very uh, comfortable environment. Um, the more I think big, Keller Williams enabled me to think bigger. Um, I just opened a mega agent office and expand my reach of my group uh, to a bigger crowd. And the limits are endless. And uh, I can go and expand to other countries. I can go to leadership role. I can go to coaching roles. So whatever I want to dream, Keller Williams will be helping me through the vehicle of the model to to reach that goal. So I've been licensed for 24 years mm -hmm. with Keller Williams, a little over three years. Um, I joined Keller Williams three and a half years ago. 24 years licensed. So I've been selling real estate in Bergen County for 24 years. When I was with my previous company, I wanted to build a team and they didn't understand. They didn't know the concept of how to build a team. So Keller Williams, I sort of watched this growth throughout Bergen County and you know, I knew that that was a place that I could bring my business and grow from there. And since coming to Keller Williams, I have been able to successfully build a very nice team where I've, you know, Keller Williams has taught me how to recruit and find talent and coach and lead talent. So that's been great for my team. And, um, you know, it's helped me to grow my business and leverage my life. So, so for me, the biggest thing with Keller Williams, the biggest reason that I love Keller Williams today and the reason I moved over was because if I wanted to grow, I knew that Keller Williams had the ability to help me grow. Where I was in my former company, it was, I was pretty successful and I like being at a table that I'm not the smartest one in the room, right? So at Keller Williams, you know, we talk about, show me the five people at your table and I'll tell you how your business will grow. And so I wanna be the dumbest person in the room. That's my goal. <laughs> but um, in terms of why I came and what works for me, so every person I meet, whether it's a seller, a buyer, an agent, a young person thinking about coming into real estate, there's opportunity for me to help them. I can help a seller get a great price. I can help a buyer find a great home. I can help an agent grow their business. I could find talent to recruit to my own team, which would be you know, something I'm always looking for great talent. And for an agent who maybe is thinking about coming into real estate, I can show them a company that's going to help them grow and learn and become the best agent they can be and hopefully grow their business. So. The opportunities at Keller Williams are unlimited. No matter which way I turn, I, there's no limit to the opportunity here for an agent, for a team, and for somebody who wants to maybe get into leadership. Uh, so that's a, very true, but there is a limit. <laughs> so I don't know any other companies that are building teams successfully like Keller Williams. Um, and I don't know any other companies that have the profit share concept and I love that Keller Williams is built by agents to for agents so it's really about how successful we can make make every agent so any agent who comes to Keller Williams we can help tell us what you want to do tell us what your business model looks like and where you want to go and Keller Williams will help you get there it's been done before it's an open books company I could pick up a phone and talk to somebody in California who has built a team similar to my market and I could introduce myself and say we've never met I'm a Keller Williams agent in Bergen County New Jersey and I would get a very warm reception and I've done that many many times the agent might not know me but as soon as I say I'm a Keller Williams agent they seem to sort of it opens doors for people it even opens doors when you know I'm doing business with an attorney I am treated very differently as a Keller Williams agent than I was as an agent with my former company because of the way we do business and the volume of business that we do. Um, no, I would say growth. Growth is a huge for Keller Williams in, in terms of 
education, you know, any business model or platform that you want to build your business on, we can find out how to help you get there. And by we, I mean leadership. You know, I, I am certainly willing to talk to agents who are newer in the business. I don't know anybody who isn't, who, I don't know any agent here who isn't willing to come to the table and help everybody in the office. Um, so growth was huge, education was huge, um, and teams for me was really a big one. I have four kids, so I needed to leverage. I needed to have my business be very successful. I needed to be able to grow a business that I could at some point step out of production and move into something else that interests me. And having a team is the number one way that I know how to do that. So I'm thankful that Keller Williams has been able to uh, help me do that. Uh, my business has doubled since I came to Keller Williams and I hope that it will double again. So in terms of what my business, well, I might even say my life is different because of okay. Keller Williams. So I think I'm a better mother because of being at Keller Williams has allowed me to experience other agents who are doing the same thing I'm doing. So at a similar level or at a higher level, at a much higher level, and also are raising kids. So for years and years I was at another company and I kept thinking, God, nobody else is, you know, I'm, I'm an, I was a pretty successful agent raising four kids and not a lot of people were able to have that combination. So it became frustrating for me because I was thinking, well, maybe it's not possible. And then I came to Keller Williams and I sort of look around and I go, okay, anything is possible. There are people raising five kids, having huge teams, having great success. So I look at that and I sort of go back to who are the five people at your table, right? So I want to gravitate to those people. Um, at my former company, I was, you know, I was probably doing five to seven million a year. And since coming to Keller Williams, I've been able to get my, my team to do 20 million in production and I'll, I'll do 40 million this year. So building my team, building my foundation, and it allows me to do those dollar productive activities that all agents should be doing, which is talking to my sphere, talking to my clients, talking to my past clients, my referrals, my, you know, people in my database, lead generating every day. So, you know, that's, that's the way we're, we're building the business to get to that $40 million in production. I do coaching. I am in coaching. Um, so what I, the reason I chose MAPS coaching was because they talk the same language as we do. So to backtrack, the thing, the, re, the way I was introduced to Keller Williams was the Red Book, the MREA book that somebody gave me. And I remember reading it and thinking, this isn't even possible. And so that was my mindset back then. And since then, I even be, at my previous company, I would Google anything I wanted a great listing presentation or how to create a, an event, a real estate event, or what, doing a great open house. And inevitably, 100% of the time, somebody at Keller Williams would have had something out there on the web that I could steal. And it kept happening over and over and I kept thinking, why is Keller Williams just keep coming up? It was like a sign, but it was also like, these other companies didn't even exist in this arena. They weren't even part of the conversation. So that sort of got me on the path. And then when Keller Williams came to Bergen County, I, I sort of watched it and I watched it explode. And then I said, okay, it's time. <laughs> um, my regret, of course, is not coming sooner. My business would have been at 40 million today if, if I did. And um, so every office has a, a packed calendar of training events that are typically very, you know, free and we can invite guests and we often do invite guests to come. Um, coaching is a little different. You pay a fee. So there's different levels of coaching. I started out in coaching by taking these, I'll call them micro classes. They're a weekly conference call that I think it's generally like $99 a month. So I used to say, well, it's the cost of dinner. So why wouldn't I go out and spend $99 to learn how to have the best listing presentation out there. So I started doing those and every one of those was just the best training I had ever experienced anywhere in 24 years of doing business. So I, you know, then I got to a point where I could afford to spend a little more money on coaching. And the reason I chose MAPS coaching versus Brian Buffini or what Mike Ferry or Tom Ferry was because we spoke the same language. So when I was on the phone with my coach, 
we would talk about either the MRA, MREA chart of accounts or a profit and loss statement or lead generation. These are not conversations that um, other coaches would be having at the same level. So I chose MAPS Coaching because it was sort of seamless into my business. That helped me. You know, the reason most people feel that they want to stay at their current company is fear. It's, I know what I have, I don't know where I'm going to. The reason I took as long as I did to join Keller Williams was because I was a 95% Remax agent. So most Remax agents are on a split. I wasn't. I was a 95%. So my f overhead was very low and my commissions were fairly high as compared to a lot of the competition. So on paper, this made no sense. My overhead was $12,000 roughly. And when I came over to Keller Williams, I knew my overhead uh, right off the bat for my cap would be $37,000. So what occurred to me was that I didn't want my business to stay the same, which is the reason I kept looking for another opportunity, another place to go other than Remax. So yes, my overhead was more than my, my previous company, but immediately my business increased. And at no time in any other company will you collect 100% at no time. So as soon as you finish your cap, which is a great incentive to get there as soon as you can, then you're at 100% for the rest of the year. So that's, that, was, that was it for me. And I, in the first couple of months, I saw that change immediately. And I, of course, went, why didn't I do this sooner? So I, that's the one thing I like to talk to successful agents about. So if an agent is new to the business, that's not important to them, right? An agent who is seasoned, maybe has a small team going or a partner, and they're making some good you know good money and maybe having a great business successfully at another company maybe they're at 13 million or 20 million that's awesome and good for them and i hope that works for them but if you came to keller williams you would be collecting 100 percent of your commissions for a longer period of time which would allow you to either invest in your family or invest in your business and grow your team so that at some point you could step out and not have to be on appointments every single day, but maybe lead generating every day, or maybe moving into another opportunity, coaching, leadership, or finding other things that you know are important to you, and still have a team running your business. Keller Williams has empowered me to build the team and the life that I've always dreamed of. It was the best move I ever made. When I came out of, um, when I got my real estate license, I went right to Remax, and they have no training. And I did very well there for, let's say, six years. And once I came over to Keller Williams, my business just soared. I'm going on 13 years. The la I'm going on four years with Keller Williams. You know, I was very comfortable where I was. I was making money. Um, I was scared to leave, but I knew I needed more in order to put a business together. Um, you know, something hit me where I thought, I have nothing to leave my children if I wanted to pass a business down and talking to other agents, you know, because when Keller Williams came here, nobody knew Keller Williams. Um, and talking to other agents that had gone to Keller Williams, I realized, you know, I need more training. I need to know how to run a business. And that's how I ended up here, to build a business, to build a brand for myself, and to have something that I could pass down or have one of my children step into and run down the, down the road. Um, I, when I was at my other company, I'm going to say my first year I was a three million agent, went up to six, came back down to three. So I, I never really went over six million. When I left there and came to Keller Williams, my first year did about seven million. My second year, I was in 10, 11 million. And this year, um, you know, I have a team also. so. Personally, I did 15 million. My team did 30 million. All of the above. I do coaching, um, training. This company is amazing. They offer so much training in your market centers, out of the market center. Um, they bring in top producing agents from all over um, Keller Williams and also from other agencies to train their agents to, to make them be the best that they could possibly be. 
And that's what I love about it. We're learning. They, they use the term success leaves clues. And to me, why reinvent the wheel? You know, we're following the models of these successful people. Um, I'm accountable. <laughs> uh, I have systems. I follow the model. All things I never did. Um, I have a business plan. I sit down every October and I go over what I did the prior year, what I want to do, what my goals are for the, for the next year, and I put a business plan together. Um, each month I do something different uh, for my clients. It, it's just, it's, it's organized. It's, it's a system. I, and it just, it works for me. And I think that's the reason um, why I be, become so successful is because I do those systems every day. You know, I do the same thing every day. Well, they explained to me, when I first came on, I didn't want to hire an admin right away. I didn't think I was making enough money, but I was so stressed learning the new system, uh, or learning eEdge and the Keller Williams way, um, that my team leader said, you really need an assistant. So begrudgingly, I did it. I was afraid to spend the money. Once I did that, things just took off. And if I didn't have somebody pushing me to do that, I don't think I'd be where I was today because then that started, okay, well now I need a buyer's agent. I was afraid, you know, are they going to want to work with them, not me. Once I did that, I hired another buyer's agent. Um, I did take on a business partner and, you know, we, we've taken over the area that we live in and um, there was an agent there for a long time. And Keller Williams brought us into 2000, now it's 17. I like to use Blockbuster and Netflix. So many people are still doing business like Blockbuster and here Netflix is 2017 and that's what Keller Williams has done with the technology. I've grown a business. I've built a business. Um, I have people working for me now. Um, I went from a $3 million agent to a 30 million team, part of a team agent. Uh, I, I'm, I can do vacations. <laughs> I can step out of my business for a little bit and have other people handle it. It runs nice and smoothly if I'm not there every day. It was the best thing I ever did. I wish I did it sooner. I had no growth opportunity. I wouldn't be where I am today. I didn't think like a business owner. I thought like a, a single agent. I never ever thought of expanding my team outside of this area. Never thought of it. And I'm sure these other companies haven't even thought about it. But you wait, in the next two to three years, they're all gonna be looking to do it because Keller Williams you know, set the standard. So I love that concept that I not only can stay here in Bergen County, I can also go to another state because we all work together. We're all, nobody's fighting, nobody's looking to cut somebody out. Um, we help each other because of the profit share. You know, um, you win, I win. Um, that's the best way I would describe it. Nobody cares for their agents like Keller Williams does. Because where we have market share, anybody who's a top agent has come to this company. Anybody who wasn't a top agent and came to this company has now become a top agent. There's, there's no reason why somebody wouldn't come here. Technology. What they're coming out with, with their technology now, is amazing. No other company's doing it. Number of years I've been in real estate is uh, 10 years of uh, this year. And the amount of time in Keller Williams, I've been about uh, just under two years. The number one thing that changed for me was the approach in real estate that I took. Um, I took it like a business now instead of just being an agent that I'm just trying to do sales. Um, I own broker and a co-owner of Prudential Elia Real Estate in Fort Lee with my family business. My, uh, my production this year has, uh, has almost doubled um, since being in Keller Williams and actually getting intertwined into the systems uh, and into the models that they have. So for me, that was something that I really needed which was a baseline foundation to then grow myself and my team from. This year, uh, I'll be slated somewhere around uh, 24 million, 25 million. Uh, the previous year, I was at about uh, just under 14 million. Uh, when I was with the other company, uh, the highest that I had was um, right around 10 million. So I maxed out of my other company just under 10 million and I couldn't grow any more from that point. Um, coming into Keller Williams and learning the systems and models, um, 
took me to the point where I then did just over around 14 million the first year, and then now this year I'm slated to do just about 25 million. Yeah, um, one of the best things I love about this company is that it's a training-based company. You have to be learning-based because new things come out all the time. So you want to stay on top of the edge of the new technology, but not really run and grab the shiny objects. So it, it's kind of a, a constant battle between understanding what's necessary and then understanding what can get you um, to the next step, so to speak, and then uh, choosing which one works better for you. I came into Keller Williams with uh, like a, a renovated house, you know, where you expand it and you do that. That's the way that my team was. It wasn't like a new construction where you build it, you had the plans and everything. So um, I dismantled my team and I figured I needed the foundation to be better and I also needed to grow my own leadership and uh, grow my own self more. So I took a couple of steps back and then with that I actually now started growing my team. So I have a team of four now and we're looking at growing to 10 within pretty much the next 12 months. Uh, profit share model is terrific. Uh, it's basically passive income which is excellent because as real estate agents, we don't have any. We don't have you know, 401ks, traditionals, like um, employees and other people in other jobs and fields. So for us, it's a way of creating income outside of the business, which means that when you retire, one day we all retire, you want to be able to have something that's coming in that's bringing you income outside of just selling. Um, so passive income through that. The other thing is also you're changing people's lives. You're giving them an opportunity to change their life which when you see it in motion and you actually see it in real life it affecting them, it, they're smiling, they're making more money, they're able to take their family on vacations, go to a, a, a nice dinner or something like that that they care about, that's when you really are like, wow, this is an amazing company. So to me, that's my special part of it. Since Keller Williams, I've gotten my life back. I feel more in control of my life, I feel more in control of my destiny, and I feel more in control of my schedule which prior I was letting my schedule respond to me, now I'm responding and making my schedule into exactly the way I want my world to be. And I was trained because of Keller Williams on how to do that. Moving to Keller Williams was definitely a transition. It's not gonna be easy when you first get into that transition because like anything, it takes a little bit to get used to it and get the feelers out there. So um, like anybody, I struggled for the first month or so just understanding that change was occurring around me. And then as soon as I started embracing it more and more and more, I realized that I should have embraced it right from the beginning in terms of the transition stage and uh, ever, ever since then it's been great. I've been learning more, I feel I'm better at what I'm doing, I feel like I'm giving my clients better service, I feel like I'm negotiating better deals, everything is just better from it. At my last brokerage I got no, no support, <laughs> plain and simple. And it was my family. And I don't mean to um, undermine my family and, and everything that they've given me, especially my father. He's done an amazing job and built an amazing company up. It was just up to that point. So we capped at that ceiling. So at my previous company, I had a vision much bigger. I had a big office vision of 300 agents and you know, in a bustling office of people walking by and coffee and phones and, and almost like a Wall Street movie. So for me, that's kind of what I always wanted and I didn't have it at my last office. So it gives you energy, you feel off of it, you know, you, you feed it, it's amazing. <laughs> there is no ceiling. I mean, if you look at people in this company, I mean, you know, Linda McKissick made over a million dollars in passive income last year. Think about that. I did not do anything other than wake up out of my bed and go to my mailbox to collect the money that was being sent to me over building a great business and changing those people's lives. I, I mean, if that isn't more of a, you don't have any cap on your ceiling, I don't know what is. I can sit here and rant and rave about the Zohars and Mirs, you know, the Stacey Esters locally of uh, uh, people, or the Ben Kinney's nationally, or the Adam, uh, Adam Hergenroth's nationally doing four or five million dollars in commissions, changing their lives and everybody underneath. But that's a little cliche. You know, we want to hear what actually goes on, which the profit share is really, to me, that's the truth behind it. My thinking is, in, in real estate, is there is no other company besides Keller Williams that I would ever want to be with. And solely for the fact is, is because the way that our culture, our technology, the people associated with leadership, and just the way that this ship is being steered is in the hands of somebody that knows exactly what they're doing. And they're focused, and they're looking at winning. And winning means helping all of their agents, because Keller Williams is an agent business. All the other brokerages are brokerage businesses. So we're just totally separate, almost apples and oranges, I call it. Uh, since last August 2016, mm -hmm. uh, seven years. Uh, it, ha it has been great. Um, I wanted to grow to the next level, and that's why I joined Keller Williams. Um, I've been doing, doing great uh, for the last seven years. Um, 
80 million till date I've sold. Um, it has been the best year so far for me uh, after joining Keller Williams. Um, already at 10 million in pending sales. It's only March, so I'm very happy to uh, be in this company. Uh, I've been in real estate for eight years now, um, and 80 million in sales till date. Um, but this year has been great. I mean, I generally do 20 million um, every year, but um, in 2017, this year, I've already done 10 million in pending sales, and it's only March, <laughs> so I'm very happy. I love the culture at Keller Williams. Um, my manager, Colleen, is really good, hands-on. Um, anytime I have any questions, she's there. My broker, Edward Kim, is excellent. Um, he's always there to help. There are few other people in the office who are always there and which I never had in the other company. So I love it at Keller Williams. The, my colleagues are very good, too. They're always there to help. And uh, we have a nice... Um, family in Keller Williams. I'm already at 10 million in 2017 with only three months that have passed. So I am hoping that instead of 20 million this year, I would do 30 million. Um, my office, the previous office was very nice too. It was a smaller office. Um, and my main aim was to get into Keller Williams is because of uh, more uh, exposure, I would say, uh, more agents, and uh, I was looking for a bigger office. So it, the, my older office was a smaller office, as I mentioned before. Uh, this is a larger platform. That's what I was looking for uh, to do, get to the next level. The year is good, right? I mean, the real estate uh, makes a big difference, how the real estate is going. Uh, everywhere. Uh, it's a seller's market and I do a lot of listings so that helps me a lot I would say um, and um, Keller Williams in general um, we have a lot of top agents in Bergen County so that I feel also helps me because um, I do work with buyers too and if uh, my other colleagues have the listings I think I get a little bit of an upper hand or at least uh, some kind of understanding is there between the agents and uh, we have four offices in Bergen County and I think um, Al Donahue is doing a great job um, since he opened the first one in 2011 and um, that's why I wanted to be in Keller Williams that uh, to be in a top office and the NJMLS it's uh, one of the, the top three offices are Keller Williams uh, for 2016 and 2017 um, I wanted to be a part of a big uh, office and uh, more exposure. The culture is excellent, I would say, yeah. Um, everybody's there to help anytime. I mean, even though I do a great volume, but I've been an agent only for seven years. So I do need help sometimes, and that's why uh, my manager, my broker, my other colleagues are always there to help. I'm hoping to. <laughs> yeah, I don't, I don't even have an admin yet, <laughs> but uh, I'm looking for one, uh, I would say, and um, I do a higher volume uh, sales, um, so sometimes I don't need uh, any help. But uh, yes, I am looking to grow uh, from one single agent to uh, building a team. That would be the best office to join Keller Williams if you're a new agent because of the hands-on training. I mean, I'm in the office every day. I don't go to the training, but there is training going on all the time and we have mentors also in the office so for a new agent uh, it should be a no-brainer to join Keller Williams uh, you're brand new you don't know anything about real estate and uh, there is a mentor to help you there are a lot of trainings going on in the office so um, it would be the best office to join because of the training. But for a new agent, I would definitely say to join Keller Williams. Generally, I do around 20 million a year uh, since the last four years. But in 2017, and I have joined Keller Williams um, last August, right? Um, it's 10 million in just, it's only March. <laughs> I would say I'm hoping uh, over 25 million, 30 million, I don't know. <laughs> so it's only March 2017. I'm already at 10 million in sales. Uh, in pending sales and um, generally I do 20 million a year. This year I think I'm on track to do 25 to 30 million dollars uh, of volume and I'm very happy to be at Keller Williams. <laughs> My name is Robert Alvarez. Oh, I love it. It's great. 
Um, just in the two years I've been here, I've learned a tremendous amount from my other company that was at previously. Uh, I mean, since I've started here, I've, I've done a lot better than what I did when I first started. Um, just with all the technology and everything that they have, it just helped me tremendously for three years. So I was with Prudential in Fort Lee for three years, and then I've been now with Keller Williams for two years. You know, I think the biggest difference is the environment and the training. Uh, the company that I was at before, it was more of a, everybody was doing their own thing. Where here, there's all kinds of training classes, everybody works together. Um, it's made it a lot easier to, to, to learn and grow from being here. Um, I mean, as far as before, I used to work m mostly with buyers and I wanted to get into listings, just really didn't know what to say or how to go about getting listings. Since I've come here, I took Bold, which is uh, one of the training, training courses that they have. And ever since then, I've been become more of a listing agent where I get a lot more listings and uh, my business is, is taken off tremendously. So at my previous office, uh, I didn't really have much direction. I didn't really know what I should be doing on a day-to-day -day basis. I would wake up early, know that I should be doing something. I just didn't know what. Um, and ever since I've come to Keller Williams, uh, one big thing that I would recommend to newer agents is to read The Millionaire Real Estate Agent. Um, it's a book that Gary Keller wrote, and it's tremendous. So it has given me direction as to what I should be doing every day, um, what activities will, will help me with growing my business. Uh, that, was, that was a big game changer when I read that. Um, and then also taking bold gave me a lot, of, uh, a lot more structure as far as what to say to people, how to go after business, and those two things really helped me out where now I have a lot more structure and, and I'm more focused. Uh, it's kind of like night and day. I mean, my previous company, everybody just kind of did their own thing. Sure, if you talk, you know, if you had a question, they would, they would help, but they really just kind of stuck to themselves and did their own thing. Um, if they had something that was working for them in particular, they probably wouldn't share. Where here, if there's something that's working really well for you, you're excelling in a certain way of marketing or something, they'll actually ask you to teach a class about it and, and help others and people will. They'll teach classes, tell you what they're doing that's working for them. Um, they, everybody you know, helps each other and uh, somebody finds something out that works, they'll, they'll share it with everybody else. It's, it's a, a lot more of a team environment as opposed to what I was used to. So the biggest change is probably that I've become more of a listing agent now as opposed to a buyer's agent. Um, I'm getting to the point where I have a lot of listings. I, I'm looking to grow a team. I'm gonna need uh, uh, an assistant at some point and a buyer's agent and um, the listings have really allowed me to, to grow. I guess as far as numbers, um, when I first came to Keller Williams, I maybe did like a million, million and a half in sales. Um, last year I did four and a half million and this year I'm already on pace for close to eight. So every year since I've been here with Keller Williams it's just doubled and uh, it, it's, I've grown significantly. You know what, just having somebody keep me accountable and, and remind me of what I should be doing. Uh, I, get, you know, I get distracted a lot, so having somebody telling me where, where I should be focusing and what I should be doing every day, uh, it, it certainly helps. It just keeps you in the mindset that you should be in. You know what, there's, there's really not. And for a while, uh, for example, when I first started in real estate, I thought that I was gonna be a salesperson the rest of my life. Um, after reading that Millionaire Real Estate Agent book, uh, Gary Keller really explains how to turn it into a business and how to grow from just doing day-to-day -day sales yourself, growing a team, uh, you know, having systems in place, and that really kind of set off a, a light bulb for me where I can really turn it into a business and then the potential is endless. So basically, like for me, just experiencing both, as both ends of the spectrum, um, a smaller, kind of family owned office where everybody kind of did their own thing and uh, a bigger office like Keller Williams where everybody helps each other, there's training, there's education. Uh, it, it just, from experiencing that, you'd be crazy not to come to Keller Williams. Um, the commission structures, the training that they offer, everything, it just, it, it, there's no other company like it. I've been an agent for a year and a half now. I, you know, when I joined Keller, when I joined real estate, I joined Keller Williams immediately. It was more because of the education and, um, you know, I talked to the team leaders and I just loved everything about it. All the agents were willing to help and I just knew it was a great fit for me. I did interview other agencies and, um, 
you know, I always came back to Keller Williams. So in the past 12 months, I've done $2.2 million in sales, um, and I'm looking to do about $5 million in sales this year. Um, I think the biggest reason for my success has been the coaching, the classes that Keller Williams has offered. You know, all the agents are willing to help, so it's not that I'm not going into this blindside. I'm always willing to help some um, ex, you know, another agent for help, and they're always willing to help me out. So I definitely think that that has been one of the main reasons for my success, as well as, you know, just the culture Keller Williams has. Profit sharing is definitely a big goal of mine to reach. Um, I don't, I see so much value in it because it's definitely long-term wealth. It's, you know, you're growing your business right now at your, your real estate sales, but profit share is going to be in the long term, and it's definitely going to be a great retirement plan as well. So I definitely, you know, building my profit share is a huge goal of mine. I love the training and I love the culture in Keller Williams and something I'm a part of as an expansion team. So it's where you take proven methods and models of mega agents and they bring it to different areas and they bring, bring in their systems and it's something I'm a part of and it's definitely going to be a huge factor of my success in real estate. I feel like there's no ceilings at Keller Williams between um, being able to earn profit share, uh, being able to be part ownership in the, in the company in itself. Um, also, you have the opportunity of actually growing a business and not just being an agent in this company. And that's one of the huge things that I love about Keller Williams. Hi, I'm Cheryl Venturini, and I'm the transaction coordinator at Keller Williams Town Life in Tenafly. I handle agents' transactions so they can continue to grow their business. Hi, I'm Cheryl Venturini, and I'm the transaction coordinator at Keller Williams Town Life. I handle agents' transactions so they can continue to grow their business. Hi, I'm Ash Taylor. I'm the Market Center Administrator. Um, I handle the financial side of the, our business here at Keller Williams Town Life. Um, what I handle for the agents is uh, processing your commission checks as well as supporting the agents with their growing their business and their financials as well as their, the tax side of their business. Um, I have 18 years of experience uh, in finance and banking, and I leverage that to really help our agents grow their business um, correctly um, and watch out for pitfalls financially. One of the great things about Keller Williams is the support that you have. Uh, myself and my colleagues are here to really help you grow your business, and the focus is on you and you being the best that you can be. So seriously, please give Keller Williams a consideration. Thank you. Hey, I'm Christina, and I am the call coordinator here at Keller Williams Town Life in Tenafly. And um, I think what I try to do is make sure that everybody has a real warm welcome when they walk in the door. I've been in sales organizations for over 30 years now, and it's really fun to see the agents come in and ring the bell and um, every other agent in the office claps for them and just make sure that um, you know, they're coming in with their, their check from a closing and they want to get paid and we try to orchestrate that as quickly as possible. Tisha Range, Ridgewood office. Joining Keller Williams has been the best thing I've done. The culture is um, just rejuvenates your whole business and uh, is really a wonderful belief system that really helps grow your business. I, I've been in real estate for 18 years, two and a half with Keller Williams, and I wish I'd made the move sooner. Um, the company is really just a wonderful uh, place to work. The training at Keller Williams, they're always looking to grow and stay with the times of everything changing in um, the environment, in technology. You can learn as much as you want to grow your business, and it's just the resources that they keep giving you are endless. I take part in the training. Um, I attend all the training sessions that I feel will help grow my business or where I feel I'm weak. They're always bringing in new people um, to help you with all of those services. I love profit sharing. Profit sharing is like Christmas morning on the 21st of each month. You're never sure how much is going to show up in your bank account, but it's always a pleasant surprise that no other company offers. Um, until you experience it, it's hard to believe that you really get a cut of the profits. By helping people create their own business in real estate and come join the Keller Williams force helps them improve their profit and also helps you improve your profit and you know by bringing people in they're growing their businesses much more than they do at other companies and then they can profit too from that. At Keller Williams I was 
getting 100% of my commission checks for over nine months of the year. That made a huge improvement in my financial situation, putting my kids through college, uh, and brought things into my life that I didn't have before by bringing in that full commission, which other companies don't ever offer you. The admin support and team support in Keller Williams is um, beyond what I've experienced in other companies. They are truly there to support the agent and make sure you have all the resources you need to get your job done. They stand behind you, they jump to do whatever is needed because they realize the business is all about the agents being able to do their job. So the support I have found extraordinary. Um, better than anything I've ever experienced anywhere else in the other companies I've worked at. The other great thing about Keller Williams is we all do try to help in the communities we live and work in. We do a lot of that through Red Day, which takes place in May. It's a fun day where we're all out doing things and um, come back to the office for lunch and then go back out and help the community. It's uh, like nothing I've ever experienced before and now each year we look forward to where we'll be helping that what community will be helping at that year. Since joining Keller Williams, my business has really become a business. I'm not just selling homes, I'm creating my own business for the future. Moving to Keller Williams was the best thing I could have done for my business, and I say to my husband all the time, I wish I had done it sooner. At my last brokerage, it was more about the company growing, not so much the individual agent, and that's the big difference I found at Keller Williams is it's really all about the agent and growing your own business with the support of what Keller Williams offers. Before Keller Williams, I sold homes. Now, at Keller Williams, I'm growing my own business. Before joining Keller Williams, I didn't realize I could reach my goals, and now I'm setting even higher goals that each year I continue to obtain. It's really been a lifestyle and career change. At Keller Williams, they're laser focused about putting the agent first. Everything they bring into the company is to help improve your circumstances and build your business. It's all about the agent and helping you grow to your maximum potential. Before Keller Williams, I was worried about the now business instead of the future business. At Keller Williams, they're teaching you all the tools you need to continue to look ahead in the future and grow your business with the goals in the future so that you're never stuck in that lull of scrambling for business. You're always thinking ahead through planning and a lot of the systems that they offer to really follow your business plan each year. Keller Williams is a company built by agents for agents and you can tell because they give you all the resources that agents truly need. Anyone who's never sold real estate always has lots of ideas but implementing them can be difficult. At Keller Williams the bottom up has experienced selling homes and really truly understands all of our needs. At Keller Williams, the other great aspect is all the agents continue to share with each other. No one is threatened by sharing their ways and the things they do because everyone puts a different twist on something, but it helps spark ideas for each other so that everyone can grow their business in a way. So it's really a great atmosphere where all the agents collaborate quite often to help improve and grow what they do um, for their clients. Keller Williams is definitely the future of real estate. They have grown in our area in such a short amount of time and continue to because they truly stay up to date with all the tools that the agents need that the larger companies just have a hard time keeping up with. We're always seems like two steps ahead of everyone else once they get to we where we are, we're at the next step. So going forward, I don't see anywhere else to work besides Keller Williams. Let's say we went to high school together and we're both real, in, in real estate and, and you want to just go like this and say, you, you got to get over here. <laughs> Are you kidding me? <laughs> don't be an idiot. <laughs> <laughs> to all those agents out there on the fence about joining Keller Williams, I procrastinated for way too long and sorry I did, so please, Come join us, don't waste any more time, and let us start helping build your business today. Awesome. Good? Yeah, that was good. Hi, I'm Anna Ennerson, team leader at Keller Williams Town Life in Tenafly, New Jersey. My role here is to make sure that we have the best training, education, technology, and a warm, inviting culture. We have a great staff here that will help your business grow. We have a market center administrator, 
We have a market center administrator. We have a call coordinator. We have a transaction coordinator. We have a technology coordinator. We have a market center administrator. We have a call coordinator. We have a, we have a technology coordinator. We have a call coordinator. We have a transaction coordinator. And we have a productivity coach. Williams is built by agents for agents. We're a company that's changing lives. The next one could be yours.